how to use equity scheduling for beginners step by step hey guys welcome in this video i'm going to show you how to use equity scheduling as a complete beginner to schedule your appointments and add a scheduling page to your website so let's get into it first of all you're going to go to equityscheduling.com and you will land on this website right here equity scheduling is also known as squarespace scheduling now it is a scheduling platform that allows you to create a scheduling page for your website you will be able to book appointments and much more so if you have an online store or you sell services you have a therapy store you have an online salon then you will be able to schedule appointments with equity scheduling how to get started well if you do not have an account you're gonna click on try scheduling it will take you right here so if you have an account on squarespace then you don't need a new account for equity scheduling but if you do not have an account on squarespace then you can create one with your google account or using your email address so i'm going to use my email now we have to enter first name last name email address set up a password and we will be getting an account on squarespace for free so after the initial sign up for Squarespace, you it will actually take you to squarespace.com and you can create a website or you can go to equity scheduling as well and select a Squarespace website. So I have selected this website right here that I had and within our you know Squarespace website, we will be able to add a scheduling page with equity scheduling. So here within our Squarespace, we have scheduling. And it will take us right here. Now, let me show you how to set up scheduling on uh, equity. First of all, we have a calendar view right here that will show you your month right now. You can see we have this month going on and it's showing me a calendar here. It will show me my uh, schedules right here. So if I scroll down a little bit, we have calendar, clients, invoices and report. Then we have scheduling page link, customized appearance availability appointment types intake form questions packages and gift subscriptions integration sync with other calendar and payment setting so you can see first of all we have to set up an availability on scheduling so here on equity scheduling i can create a new calendar and i can set an availability so here you can select how many hours you will be working i have regular hours every week then you will select the day here we have we work from monday till uh you know uh friday so what i can do is i can select the day and then i can add the time for instance i'm available on thursday from 10 to 5 so i will click on enter and it will customize the time for me similarly we can add on friday so adding time is really easy all you need to do is just enter like uh again i'm gonna add 10 to 5 click enter and it will be added right here so now you can see i'm available from monday to friday on this time this, this this is our timing so i will click on save regular hours and this availability will be set now i will create different appointments and different uh types of you no know, events according to this availability r this is where you will add different calendars as well and you can create more than one availability for different types of uh appointments so once the availability is set you, we can go back and now you will actually go to the appointment types here you will be able to create types we also have add-ons and we can also create coupons in order to create a new uh, or a product then you're going to click on new type of services here or you can also create a group class i'm going to click on new type of service and here we have to enter what we do for instance i actually provide therapy so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go for online therapy session that's what my product is known as these are my appointments so i'm going to add the name here online therapy so we have to select the duration for the uh you know meeting so i will add one r there you go that is being, like we have actually 60 minutes and then we have the price so the price for one therapy session is 50 dollars. so i'm going to add it right here then we have the category so category is actually this one here and we can also select a color to just schedule it better to organize our work then we have a picture as well if i want to upload then i will add it right here and then we have access so we have two types of access i can actually get, make it public so it will be added on my scheduling page and all uh, anyone who visits my page can book a session or i can go with a private where i can only share this link to specific clients who can book so i'm gonna go with public because i want people to it's an online session so we actually go global and people will be able to create an appointment hit create appointment type and it will be created right here uh, within your equity scheduling and then it will be added to your website 
So now you can see I have a new appointment type created. I have set up availability. I have set up appointment type. Now, the next step is actually there are, there are different clients as well, invoices that I'll show you in a minute. Let me show you how to add equity scheduling to your website. So for that, you're going to go to client scheduling page. You can see scheduling page link. Click right here. And here we have different types of links available. So with equity scheduling, we can not only add this equity scheduling to just Squarespace website, but we can also add it to other website. First of all, we have a general scheduling page. Your client scheduling page is what clients will schedule on. So what I can do is I can copy this link. This is going to be the link for my scheduling page and I can add it to any other website I want. And then we have a direct link and embedding. This is for Squarespace. You can see we have Squarespace here. Then we have a direct link option that will directly take my clients to the page. Then we have a booking button. So if you want to create a booking button on your website, then you will uh, add this uh, code right here. You're going to copy the code and add it into your button. Then we have a booking bar. If you have a bar, then you will copy this. And then we have embed other. So if you're going with embed option, then you will copy this code. So you can see we have different types of ways to link and embed uh, equity scheduling to a website. So this is really important. So you will be able to find it right here under client scheduling page, scheduling page link. This is where you will find the link to add it to your website. So uh, this is how you create availability, appointment types and add equity scheduling to your website. Now, let me show you if you want to create invoices, you're going to switch to invoices right here. And this is where you will create invoices for the clients. We also have client list that I can create here and we can also import and export a client. Um, so I'm going to click on add client here. Let's say I have a new client that I need to add. So I'm just going to enter their name, enter their last name. Then we're going to enter their phone number or email address, uh, add some notes, click on add clients and this client will be created. We can again import and export a list as well. This is actually uh, pretty good that we can add a CSV file. So similarly, I can now add integrations too. And we also have an appearance so we can customize the appearance of our equity page. If you want to go for a monthly view, like a calendar, or you want to go with a daily. So it totally depends on you, uh, what you want on your website, you will be able to actually customize your equity scheduling page with customized appearance right here. Similarly, we have the scheduling page options too. I can create and select different templates. For instance, if I want to go with a button, if I want to go with different requirements, then I will be able to customize the appearance here. Uh, similarly, we have our intake forms too. We have packages and integration. So we can integrate different types of, you know, uh, scheduling and different types of accounting softwares to our equity scheduling. We have QuickBooks, we have FreshBooks, Squarespace, MailChimp, we have ConvertKit, Drive, we have Google Analytics that we can add, we have Salesforce, we have uh, different CRM platforms. Then we have some of the chatting, we have Zoho, Stripe, Square, PayPal. So these are the different payment methods that we can also add. Uh, in payment method, Stripe is available, Square is available, and PayPal is available as well. That will allow you to add a very simple and easy payment method to accept payments on your scheduling page. So yeah, guys, this is how you set up equity scheduling. It's a very easy to use scheduling platform that allows you to add appointment page to your website. I hope that I was a big help to you guys. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, leave a comment down below, turn on bell notification and subscribe to YouTube channel.